seven months. It has been seven months since I was last here. Hard to believe it. Here, watch this. There it is. February 28th, 2017 was the last time I touched this. And in all that time, I have not been tempted to play Fallout 4. Yeah, here we are. We are here now playing it once again. Very late on October 1st, 2017. Is it because October is such a fallout sort of month? Possibly. It's because the dopamine receptors in my brain have now properly resensitized themselves. I'm no longer requiring more and more to get any kind of rush out of this. By the way, thank you, game theorists. Yes, probably that too. But I think more to the point, there's now actually something I want to to do in this game. Actually, several things that I want to do in this game. I've come around to wanting to try to set up different things, different things with the settlements. Yes, I'm eventually going to try and go back over the last two DLCs that I never touched. But not just yet. Right now, I want to achieve the Mechanist's dream. The Mechanist's dream of robots roaming the Commonwealth, stamping out oppression and injustice. And my robots, which are, you'll notice, are extremely different from the Mechanist robots, are just the robots to do that. Follow me on this as we go to Sanctuary. Now, these settlers that you can see right here, they have everything they could possibly need to be 100% happy. And yet, when you look at the overall data, let's go to workshops, let's find Sanctuary Hills. It says that they're only 74% happy. Why is that? It's because some of those people aren't people. They're robots. And because they're robots, they can only be 50% happy. Now, the solution to this, and I've known of this solution for some time. I just never thought I'd put the effort into you know, implementing the solution, is to move all my robots, or probably, you know, it's going to be most of my robots. There'll be some that are on... You know, out there roaming the wastes already because they're already on supply lines. Yeah, I won't be able to find them, that kind of thing. But put most or not all of my robots into settlements that don't have people. One of them is the Red Rocket Truck Stop, which I am deliberately keeping as my own personal player house and storage area. It's my keep. So, I mean, the happiness is never going to be any better than 50 there anyway. And the other one, of course, is... The Mechanist Lair, which has two people. One of them is a robot, probably, and uh, the other one is, of course, Isabella Cruz, a.k.a. The Mechanist. And the happiness there is never going to be more than 50 because, well, have you met Isabella? Not a happy person. No, no. I may sticking a whole lot of robots. Well, that'd be interesting if we could raise her happiness by surrounding her with the robots. But you can't... That's not a normal settlement. So if you send all of your robots to either the Mechanist Lair or, in my case, Red Rocket Truck Stop... Um, you can therefore allow all of the other workshops, all the other, all the other settlements, to gain a happier happiness. And that's what we're going to attempt to do. And uh, just because of some of the things I've noted from Oxhorn, I've been watching a lot of Oxhorn uh, videos as of late. I'm going to put the bigger robots at the Red Rocket and the smaller ones at the Sunshine, at the, sunshine, at the, uh, the, what, the Mechanist Lair. Because it's hard to move around in the Mechanist Lair and the big ones get stuck. So that's how we're gonna do that. And let's see, let's get this let's get this show on the road. Everything seems to be proceeding according to plan, sir. Sergeant A Pickles! Pleasure to see you again, sir. Our we're gonna move Sergeant Pickles. He's pretty big and clunky, but we're gonna send Sergeant Pickles to where's Red uh, where's the Red Rocket truck stop? There you go. Send him to his new home. And we go over here. These are a lot of smaller ones. Everybody to the limit. Yeah, we're going to move him to the... Uh, let's move him to... Where are we at here? Come on. The Mechanist Lair. Go. Let's see. Fahoa Gods, he's got to go with the... He's definitely moving to the Mechanist Lair. we got to keep those two together. They're, the names are significant. The Mechanist Lair. Confirm. Scrapping Steve. He's, we're going to keep him local because he's such a slow mover and he's not very well armed. 
move him. We're gonna move him all the way up to all the way down to the Red Rocket truck stop. Scrap and Sally. Obviously, they're they're close. We're gonna keep them together. We'll move them to the Red Rocket truck. Move them to the Red Rocket as well. Now, where is? Oh yes, my defender. Sergeant Primero, the first robot I ever made. We're moving you to the Red Rocket Truck Stop. You're going to be part of that. Oh, there goes Oh God. He's on the move. That's Scrap and Sally. She's on the move. Let's see. Do we have any other robots floating about? And they're just going to walk down there. And you know, it's what I have discovered in the past is if you're with them while they're walking, uh, they can be killed. So you want to not be there for that. I'm going to look and see, do we have any other robots out here? Well, somebody got wiped. Hopefully that's one of the bad guy robots. Okay. Lightning Larry. We're going to move him. Lightning Larry is going to be moved. He's because he's a small and mobile robot. To the Mechanist Lair. Yeah, he's he's off. Anybody else coming up? So as far as I can... Because we're moving out. Okay, we will exit the workshop. So we get cows on the move. Alright, well that's a human one anyway. Yeah? the dog is. Alright, hey, we already got a robot here. I wonder how long my systems will endure these rugged conditions. No, it, you're, you're, you'll be fine, okay? We're going to supply line you to... Oh, where the heck is it? They're, I think, why are they out of alphabetical order? That's really annoying. I'm just jumping over my eyes tired. Starlight drive in. Why can't I send him back to where he just sent he just came from? I want to send him to the sanctuary. Hmm, if I start running into stuff like this. Guess where? Huh, why can't I send him? Do we have too many going to Sanctuary Hills? This is an interesting glitch. Alright. Where should we send him then? Maybe this is just a timing thing. Let's Let's wait. Let's cancel. Maybe maybe things have to be kind of reassigned here a little bit. Monitoring the Commonwealth is proving to be quite rewarding. What a fascinating place. Yeah, there's something here because he's outside where I can reach him. Let us go to... Come on. Let's fast travel to somewhere else and come back. One of the places that I was really concerned about with this was the slog. Because there's some robots I'm very fond of. It's a slog. And, I, and the one thing about making them a supply line robot is they can't get killed then. It's when they, any kind of person you really don't want them to get killed, make them a supply line person. And, you know, they can, I think, glitch out and disappear, which is about the same thing. But I don't think they can actually die in combat. But help defend Sunshine Tidings. Well, yes, in a moment. Yes. Where the heck did this iron hide? Is that one of the things where I assigned yes. him up here? And then he never came up Damn top. fog's got in my lungs again. Well, we, we don't have the fog here. We got music going. I don't remember leaving music on this thing. Watch, now it'll demonetize me. Where the heck is that big red robot? Ah, 
does anything with this ever go smoothly? Like, seriously. Okay, so it seems we have some limitations that we have to work with, but I think in the long run it's going to work out okay. We can only send one one supply line from one place to another. We can send multiple supply lines from different places to the same place. It's just... I can't stack them the, quite the way I want to, but I can still have large amounts of robots just roaming the landscape. I'm moving these to the mechanism there because they're smaller. For as many as I can move. It will max out at some point. Now, I am losing out on a lot of junk creation here, but I have such a supply of junk just from all the water I create. It's almost not... That's something I'm concerned about, you know? This was a good idea at one point, but I think these can be better served roaming the landscape. Obviously, some are going to require upgrades. I've been doing some upgrades all along, but I'm not going to do this many. I'll, I'll be broke. Let's see. We'll give them some better, more useful names as we move them around. Well, this should make, you know, Miss Isabella Cruz really happy. That's, we got that going for us. That, that won't mean anything in game. The happiness there isn't going to go up. It's going to be stuck right at 50. But, still, it's as happy as she gets. Get the construction Carl over here. We'll have to send him to the construction site. We'll <laughs> be the supply line. Move floating flow again. To the tight confines of the mechanist lair. Have we got any robots left here? Oh, this one over here, yes. That's a particularly good one. Sergeant Oddball. Okay, very cool. Let's we gotta make him into a tank. Matter of fact, let's let's do that present. We got to, got to, got to. Craft. Sergeant Oddball. Let's see. Legs. We definitely have to go with Robo, Robo Brain Tread. Yeah, let's see. Waste Armor. Factory. Can't be factory. Can't be stopped. This is odd. Primal Plate. Primal Plate looks good. Primal Storage Plates, probably. Ooh, mid war. That's that's got kind of more of a tank look to it. Yeah, let's do the treads mid war mumble please. The voice paint is still there. Vanilla paint. No, you're going. You're going. Back to the paint. Let's see. Torso. Um, storage. Just to match everything up a little bit. New concept. Let's use the resistance here. Make everybody around a little sick. Then we need to go left arm. Left arm armor. Gonna stick with the look. Um, let's see. Toxic though, there you go. That's that's it. Head head armor. He definitely needs we'll give him the Spartan. Hey, don't know. This? Now we put the oddball. The turtle helm. The berserker helm. And hydraulic. The 
Goblin Helm, Head Center, uh, I think we'll go... Cyclops is the most useful. We'll just go with that. Dude, what does that... What's the arm do? That's just a clip. It's a new one. Yeah, we gotta do better than that. Something very tank like. And then we need something. Automatic laser. Automatic laser works. But you know, this is based on Gamma Gun. The gamma Gun kind of looks like the acoustic kind of thing that they used that uh, Oddball used to have. Uh, just a huge speaker. Not yet. We'll give him an unstable uh, laser gatling on one side because he's oddball, obviously, unstable. And then let's see. Is there armor on there? Armor? None? Oh, Grim plate. Not so bad. He's too nice. Grim, what's with the negative waves? Why always with the negative waves? Over here, then we'll put the gamma gun. Just just so it has that one. If we can. Yes. A ten gamma. Now he's a big knot. So we're gonna send him. Come back here. Move. Him we're gonna send to the red rocket. I want him out of my, my home base. I forgot I had some T60 power on that beer. Yeah, well, it's a good place for it. Okay, now where do we send it? The whole point Oddball was out behind enemy lines off in the distance. Side. Probably would be a good, a good choice to send to uh, Nuka World or something like that. Then again, just having him loafing here kind of fits the name. The only problem with that is, is that the longer I leave him on a sign, the longer he's vulnerable. This, this guy can get taken out right now. It's just a matter of time. So we need to get him something. So, for those of you who don't know, Sergeant Oddball here is from Kelly's Heroes, an excellent film about robbing a bank. So I was trying to think where the best place to send him with a bank was. We could send him to a town near a bank. And... Right here, the USS Constitution is sitting on a savings and loan. So if we assign him to Bunker Hill and send him that way, first of all, it'll take him through areas where he's more likely to meet raiders, and therefore that gamma gun will work better. And, uh, of course, you know, defending, he'll, he'll be running back and forth between here and there. And his destination is close to where uh, you'd expect Oddwell to be going, to go rob a bank. I, I don't know if that's the right way. I think that's the opposite direction. I guess you can get there from here. I, I, I. Now where is he? Okay. That's fine. See, now this is what I'm trying to avoid. This, this poor bot got knocked out during a raid ages ago. And there's not even a way to clean him up. I'm thinking maybe if I delete all of this. Maybe if I store the shock floor. That didn't even work. I have to scrap it to get rid of them. Ah, you won't believe what I heard on the radio. Isn't that going on? It okay. sounds like the Minutemen are back in action. Yeah, yeah. Let's see how long. You yeah, think? You might not be happy to have them back, but I am. Our database are continuing to accumulate vast amounts of data regarding the Commonwealth. Is that the dead one talking? Okay, this is interesting. I came out here to defend the checkpoint, which I didn't even know was out here by the mark water. And look what I found. You don't have too many sets of armor. Especially when it's raining. Figure this out. It's treating it like I've got a helmet and I don't. That looks like an old helicopter. You could call it a vertebrate, but it doesn't quite jive. I don't know, maybe it's, a, it's the angle, but... Could be a jet of some nature? Nothing new to report, Joe. I guess not. 
There he is. What? How did you hear it? That makes no sense. Okay, we're gonna move him. We've started a mission. You there. All right, we're gonna get you back. Can't go there. Can't go. You can get. You can go back to Hangman's Alley. Okay, just for a moment here, we're going to have to talk about charisma. Now, as you can see, mine is pretty darn high. That's because, you know, I'm wearing 15 because I got all this uh, figure of apparel. Where is it? There we go. The sharps. The sharp improves operator's heavy chest piece, gives plus one to charisma. This gives uh, plus one to charisma. Let's see, the wedding ring doesn't. The wedding ring should give plus to charisma, right? That make, would make more sense. The green shirt and combat boots gives plus one to charisma. And that's now these give other things. If I can get some sharp pieces here, we go even higher. The you know, the black uh, rim glasses, which apparently I have two of those in my inventory, but they give one to charisma. I think I'm only getting one because only one is. And, and we've got my army tr armored trilby hat, which also gives one to charisma. So I've got a lot of charisma, which means that the maximum size of my settlements is up around 25 normally. There are tricks to get around that, and you will see one here. You can see, you know, mostly Boston Airport isn't really a thing. But the older stuff is getting closer. 20, 14, 23. They're not all loaded yet. But if you look at the Red Rocket uh, truck stop, that's at 20, uh, 23. That's because I think I accidentally moved I moved a couple robots that were already assigned from Red Rocket. So there might be a little room there, but still, it's close to the, the limit. It was at the limit before. And the Mechanist Lair is at 26. I can't put any more people there. So the interesting thing is I've, I have more than 50 robots. So I've had to put them all someplace. So I've, I've moved all the people out of Hangman's Alley. This is a temporary holding station there. And my plan is to increase my charisma temporarily and then move the robots to either the Red Rocket uh, truck stop or hang uh, over to the Mechanist Lair once I kind of get an overload going. Uh, and uh, failing that, I'm going to try to move some, I think, to Grey Garden because there's already a bunch of robots there. I forgot about Grey Garden. That's a robot place. Now. There are going to be some robots left in the wild because I know I just saw Sea Spray. He had a, a run going into uh, Spectacle Island, and I thought, well, you know, with all the with all the supply runs, there's going to be robots out there that are going to be difficult to find. So it's not going to be perfect, but I'm going to achieve the overall effect of having a lot of robots going out of these few places and basically scourging the the Commonwealth with anything bad. But to do that, we need to do a little bit of chem crafting. In. Regular viewers of this channel know I don't really do a lot of chems in this thing. It's not really my thing. But the grape uh, mentats give you plus five charisma for eight minutes. So now we've got two. They take a lot to make. I mean, that's, you know, they have a pretty, uh, and the whiskey alone is hard to get. But now I've got great mentats, so let's take a look at what you know what we'll do though. In the video, we're just gonna go right over to Hangman's Alley. I'm gonna kill a little time in actual game right now. I'm gonna go do a do a water run just to make sure all the robots that I've moved to Hangman's Alley actually get there. Because uh, one of them was Ironhide, he's coming all the way up from Longfellow's cabin. And they don't, when you move them, they don't transfer instantly. They actually roll through the Commonwealth. So let's, let's kill a little time and then I'll meet you at Hangman's Alley. Okay. It looks like the crew is largely here. This is a beaker. Oh, I turned off the beacon. I thought I moved everybody. Most robots aren't self aware. You can hardly blame them for carrying out their function until the end. But. Let's do this thing now. So here's the plan. 
go to inventory, aid, and we have eight minutes to work with this, so... According to my files, potential side effects of that chem are nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. Or are you attempting the trifecta? There you go. Now, Ironhide. We're going to now move him, and we should be able to move him, yes, to the Red Rocket truck stop. Yay! Let's see. Here we got Duncan Johnny, we'll drink Cornholio, we'll move him to the Red Rocket. Out of my board. Rocket. Um, somewhere here we should have. Rekdar. He's already at one of them. Melon Head. We're gonna move you to the, uh. To the mechanist lair. Dakadani. He can go to the mechanist lair. If there's anyone. This is gonna get. Confusing. It's almost like, you know, like, well, gee, which ones did I send? Which ones? Uh, and there's all these. Just walking through the corner. Move. I'll go Red Rocket. We can't move the corner. Come on, man. You can see why I made two things of great mentats in case I run out of time. Come on, Red Rocket. Oh, there he is. Ooh, he's definitely a Red Rocketer. And Red Rocket. Uh, we'll, move, we'll move him. He's unassigned. Oh, yeah, let's see. If we, I guess we should do Red Rocket as long as there's room with the Red Rocket. Did you see that up there? Did I pass it? Did, did we load the Red Rocket? Or did I do him already? More likely I did him already. This is still Rekgar. Okay, I, I, I picked the wrong guy. He's already moved. This guy. Ah, we'll move him. Okay, Red Rocket's maxed. So, make it a slayer. Fortnite already did part of it. Flash already did. They're all on the move. So we might have done it. Try to move him, and we can't get to one of the. Uh... So the red rockets filled. Does. Oh, yeah. They're all. Moving. So now that's going to take some. So, yeah. Let's do the time warp again. Ah, and the great man has to be out. Who's this guy? Identity confirmed. Lightning Bill. Okay, we got to move him. But to where? Not any place I normally would go. Oh, gee, I have to burn another great Mentats to move Lightning Bill. And I said there are going to be some outliers. Maybe leave light. He, he's already the main thing about assigning them to a supply line is that makes them invincible. And all right, let's see. If I've gotten most of this, the large collection of uh, robots taken care of. Let's see, can he be moved here? Is he part of... I think Lightning Bill may be assigned to Nuragden Beach. Well, we'll see. We'll see where the... Uh, we already have a happiness at 80, so let's, it's dropping. But there's a type of robot here. But we'll, he'll be back. Who's this? Wandering Jack. Get two here. 
Let's at least upgrade Wandering Jack. Identity confirmed. Craft. Wandering Jack. If you're gonna wander Jack, you better wander this time. Let's see. Head. Robo brain. I like the Robo Brain head. They got that. It gives you an extra weapon, you know? Just to make Wandering Jack a little bit of a philosopher. Legs. Mr. Handy Thruster. It simplifies things. And you just have the thruster armor. We could put the voltaic frame on it. And because both will up, we'll arm him up with the mirror. What kind of towards uh, Superior health and build with the overheating. Ah, rubble break is good. Front uh, armor. Yeah, we'll go in the third voltaic roof here. Let's go all the way up. We'll give him max arms. Do we want Wandering Jack to have like nuclear and stuff? That might be a bit excessive. I think like Wandering Jack. You wouldn't expect to be that far out there. Okay, so they'll be bleeding and burning at the same time. How can that not be the right the right answer to that? Paint. What color just kind of captures one? Orange is calling to me. How y'all doing? I'm ordering deck. Why would you order for that? Is it with TF2? Red paint? Red would be good. Back in the 90s when I used to work in a glass factory, we had some giant orange robots that would be killing you in an instant if you were in the cage with them. The moving 40 inch panels. Once again, this is what we're trying to avoid. Poor Sergeant Dampier. Can we, can we usually use him as a storage device? <laughs> He's become a cabinet. But, had he been on a supply line, that would not happen to him. Now, there's a chance he might just disappear. These things could just disappear, but that's a glitch, not really a game function. As far as game function is concerned, it's all, uh, they should be pretty much invulnerable, is my understanding of the way the game functions. Okay, here we are back at the red rocket. We're gonna dump all my junk. And... Let's take a look here. Okay. There are a lot of robots it's a rather here. rather pleasant evening, wouldn't you say? Still don't see Ironhide. Hmm. Self-diagnostic complete. I'm happy to report I won't be falling apart on you anytime soon. You lead the way and I'll follow, sir. We got a lot of stuff. We have the entire Commonwealth to explore. 
Where should we go we next? We need some upgrades. Craft. There's a lot of them here. Noodle McDoodle. Okay, he's done. He's already set up. I guess we should go look at stuff here. Let's 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 see what needs to be done. I guess when we got him here, we should assign him. Now where supply lines? Noodle McDoodle. Patrolman, Noodle McDoodle. Maybe Taffington, Country Crossing. Bunker Hill would be a good I'm thinking an inner city kind of thing. Could go to Hangman's Alley. Or Hagen Beach. Croup Manor. Croup Manor needs some heavy guns. That's that's too rough a place. Kingsport Lighthouse. Coastal Cottage, I want to send something that's more. Zemoja, Ten Pines Bluff. Starlight Drive-In. I can see him going to the Starlight. Yeah, the cops checking out the Starlight just to see if there's any lovers doing the wrong thing in the dark after hours. Let's see. If we can do it. Okay, you're set. Identity confirmed. This Sergeant Primero, I know he's unit is ready to serve. Wait a minute, this is Sergeant Primero. That can't be Sergeant Primero. Sergeant Primero is already all kitted out. Did I make two by no? This must be some kind of glitch. I saw this on one of Oxhorn's videos, I think, where one of the things we've heard of. Well, let's, let's do them up. Oh, we're going to do them up differently, in case I have two Sergeant Primeros. I'll remember that this is the... Uh... I had the assault on head laser and I got the robot rain, that's so we'll go with that. Okay. Legs. Movement speed. That takes nuclear material. So far, he's going to look awfully like Sergeant Primero. If we do it that way. Let's make him a floater. Although, maybe it's all time. Make him an assaultron with a robo brain head. Hydraulic brain power. Did he just get. Did that go up one again? Hydraulic. I mean, we still have it. I'll use it later. We're going for a certain build here. Right? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. 
That was a little superior melee damage. If I do a double melee, does that mean he'll be one of those that kind of rushes up and just beats the crap out of you? That really is my sergeant, but my first robot completely reimagined now. And we'll send him. Yeah, Sunshine Tidings is in a bad, uh... Well, actually, Kenny is. Um, let's, let's do Sunshine Tidings. I'm gonna end up sending one to pretty much every single settlement, so... Let's do a little bit of time warp again. Major, major, if we can send him to the castle, which is where he came from. Have we already sent one to the castle from there? Mechanist Lair, the visitor center. We do need to send one to Longfellow's cabin. And he's particularly robust. No, I want to send one of the, uh, the, the sea-themed ones to, to that side of things. Outpost Zimonja. And here we have Salty, freshly upgraded. Anybody getting the uh, Thomas the Tank Engine reference? But he loves the sea! So what we're going to do is we're going to send Salty up to old Longfellow's cabin. He'll share all sorts of sea shanties, stories, things. No, you can't give them like lots of like you couldn't have like an actual voice because like the old sea captain voice. Arg, be ready to serve ye. We'll send him to Longfellow's cabin. Confirm. Which I think patches a hole in the uh, in in the supply lines that gets supplies out to. Too far harbor. So, we continue. Okay, this was originally a pizza bot. Named after uh, one of the local. How shall I put it? Pizza Masters of Northeast Pennsylvania. 
But what we're gonna do is we're gonna give him a little bit better be weapon. If he's a pizza guy, having like a flamethrower kind of makes sense. I think Oberlin Station could use some pizza. It's astounding how much we still have to discover out here. Whatever it is we're out here looking for. I'm certain we'll find it soon. A pleasure to see you again, sir. Are you ready to depart? Okay, we send him to Somerville Place. I can't remember where that is, so where the heck is Somerville Place? Kind of off on the edge of the map. Oh, that's all the way down here. It's one of the worst places you could possibly go. That seems kind of cruel. Let's let's change that. Um, where is he? He's still standing there. All right, let's let's do something. Supply line. Ten Pines Bluff. That's a much. That's closer. This in Somerville place needs a tank. And look who's here. It's Ironhide. All right. This is the one. This is actually the robot that really started for me. This is the one I wanted to protect. I've already seen him die once, actually, because I, I went to move him and follow him back to see what would happen if you followed the robot back. And he basically nuked himself. So. Let's exit the station. Confirmed. He doesn't need anything. Man. Give me a better voice. Supply line. The slog. That's where I wanted to send him the whole time. Back to the slog. That was the main move of all of this. Okay, let's see. Trajectory. You get it? He was an artilleryman at the castle. So it's a tragedy because he was a Tory. Yeah, it's all kinds of little historical, jokey kind of things here. Where do we want to send him? Um, let's see. Someone's got to go to Hangman's Alley. And that's downtown, and it's... Yeah, we'll do that. I wonder how many we could stack up in there. Identity confirmed. This unit is ready. That wasn't what I planned. I still can't believe I finally met my real father. We can keep traveling as much as you want. Ready to what are you? Why is? I'm afraid I'll be unable to extract any useful. All right, hold on. Move. Where can we move you? You have no people. The guy. I'm gonna end up using that other great mentat. Pleasure to see you again, sir. Ah, Sean. How the heck did you end up here? Sir, are you ready to depart? Now with all my charisma. With all the charisma I can muster. Come on, get into the freaking... Rust -proof radiation. I still can't believe I finally met my real father. Move. Back to the castle with you. Or should we send him to the slug? There's a lot of interesting people at the slog. You can go to the slog. Slog is maxed out even with that, so you're gonna have to go. You should have cut. You should get back there. Where's the castle? Going, get going. I could, I could put him on a supply line. That'd be just wrong. Um, while we're here, 
zapping Zelda. Now you're going, you're going down to Somerville Place. There's lots of stuff to zap there. Go, go, go. Target long shot. You're already built up. Let's see. Any green top nursery? Nothing wrong with that. Private splish splash. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna assign you to let's see. Kingsport Lighthouse. And we'll have to do something with the present. Luigi! Okay, we're gonna have to we're gonna supply do you too. Supply line. Luigi here is gonna go. He's gonna go to the Finch Farm. No, let's see. P Luigi, by the way, another pizza place around here that I like. Visitor center if I do some upgrades. Okay, let's get back upstairs. This is just hilarious. I got it. Nope. Your iron hide, you're in the way. I need to craft. Okay, Luigi can do quicker. Legs. We have the entire comic world to explore. Where should we go next? Identity confirmed. This unit is ready to and um, that arm will leave with the pizza thing. Left arm, I think we'll go the same kind of. Where is the flamethrower? Uh, go all the way up there. Is she skip off? Maybe. This unit cannot proceed. I think he doesn't Not have any. Let's have flamer. This feels like a better flamer. I'm going to be with a bigger arm. Yeah, let's just look at the flamer. Although I did put a voltaic frame on that, didn't I? Let's just let's, let's, let's go for it. Oh, one more thing. No, maybe one more thing. He's Luigi. That's olive green paint. I don't know if it's working for me. Look at this green paint. There's no good drill. Here we are. Just dark green paint. Is it changing color? There's no good green. That's why I went with all in the first place. Huh? Gesture. State command is clearly for proper response. Yeah, before he gets away, private splish splash. You need to. <laughs> it's just getting ridiculous. And a cow suddenly appears. Mini cows. Alright, private splish splash. You're not gonna get that much in the way of upgrades. We're just gonna. Give you the best armor we can give you on here. Take your time. Hydraulic is water. Flash would make big, you know. Well, yeah, I don't want to. I hate using explosive minigun because then if he hits any near anybody around, the area effect will hurt people. So I don't generally. I hope I haven't said anything. Same with the flame. Right? Yeah. So the pizza people are going to be a problem. But... I'm sorry. Were you waiting for me? What 
would be... Well, I guess a, a, a skull mace might be a little piratey. A little piratey kind of thing. I don't know. Legs. Make you a flyer, too. I assume your silence means you're in deep thought. Take your time. Okay, he's already been assigned. Wow, look at this. The daily choices you humans need to make for oh, death must be quite Bethesda. Bethesda. Seriously? I, we gotta keep going. This unit is ready to serve. Can we even, you know, can we even get to the Let's thing? Get around the robot components. This unit I, is I can't to select it anymore. All right, let's see if we can get them to to break it up. That was foolish. Are you, Are you damaged? damaged? All right, let's see. Razor Ramon supply line. Where are we gonna send Razor Ramon? Spectacle Island. Now he's not a floater. You think he's a he's not a thruster guy? Require construction. Well, Although Spectacle Island, where you know. Which has kind of an arena, and Razor is named after a wrestler. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, need some upgrades. Buds McKenzie, we're gonna all melee character. <laughs> Supply line him to. Yeah, the, why not? The Warwick Homestead. They'll find him entertaining. Boom Boom. What's Boom Boom got going? Some kind of gun, some kind of fine. Supply line, Boom Boom. Yeah, we'll go to the Finch Farm. Wait, you know what? Let's see. Maybe we should really send him to, like, you know, Echo Lake Lumber Mill or something. I'm going to need some stuff out there. And he's going to have to walk underwater, but... Which is kind of a continuity break for me, but, you know. Okay, supply line. Yeah. Wow, I'm actually going to run out of places to send them. That's interesting. Grey Garden. Good pizza at Grey Garden. That'll be good. K is actually, K is actually named after, uh, K is actually named after K's, which is my current, um, go-to place that's close to work. The pizza's awesome. Now, let's see if we can upgrade. Everything seems to be proceeding according yes, to plan. Let me in. Ready to serve. I cannot get to her. Look at this. I appear to be well built for travel. Come you on. should be commended for a job well done. Identity yeah. confirmed. This unit is ready. Got it. Ready to serve. Let's see. A pleasure to see you again, sir. Are you ready? Yeah, that's the light. I'm cool with that. Right arms. Saltron claw. We gotta go we gotta go we gotta go big. Laser Gatliner. Oh, there's so many optics here. Hydraulic frame is good. Are We're gonna put okay? a laser on there. Let's let's up the laser. That's that's just a scene. It really is. Yeah, I'm gonna just stand here and see if more cows are I, I think it's the pretty much maximum glitch. A consequence of being mechanical in nature. Most robots aren't self-aware. You can hardly blame them for carrying out their functions. Well, what did I do that was different? They're deploying. 
A pleasure to see you again. Mm. Out of my gourd. That one just got here, so they're still arriving. Supply line. To the Finch Farm. That was a farmer too. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, he's, he's got something kind of working on. I think it's a, little, a regular laser and a, a thing. The Finch farm can get violent, but I think out of my guard can probably. Well, let's see. Can we put a bigger gun on him? Well, Most that's going to Most aren't self aware. You can hardly blame them for carrying out their function until the end. That'll do you better. Is it kind of hard to always Fine. And cow in tow. Where am I getting all these cows? He's been picking up a lot of stuff. Hey. Great. Ah, just got to impact on him. The great cornholio has it on it. See, what would be the, the great best place for the great cornholio? He looks like a construction bot. <laughs> you send him down to the kind of burnt water? That'd be just too wrong. I mean, Dalton Farm would be good. I've been going through the ocean. Ah, there is much water. Why am I walking through water? Let's get one down to Merc Water. Lead on. There's so much I have to discover. Although, you know what? It seems wrong. To not have some link to the, the mechanist layer. And that way we'll get to see him more often. My line, yeah. So he's he's assigned to the mechanist layer. Excellent. And just that quickly, just that quickly, pretty much we've emptied the place out. Now, we'll come back later in case anyone else shows up from their travels. Let's go check out the mechanist layer. Wow. My Just, are continuing to function it's like a disco efficiency. robot dance party. Commonwealth is proving to be quite rewarding. Everything what seems to be proceeding place. according to plan, sir. <laughs> it's a pleasure to serve with you, sir. Oh my goodness, this is going to be a lot of work. I don't know that I don't just want to leave it like a constant disco robot dance party here in the mechanism. I wasn't aware that around the mean, really, yes, they can be hurt, but they're not leaving here, and nothing ever really spawns in here. Perhaps if more robots possessed by the did, they could get it out. It wouldn't be forced to destroy it. It seems like it's a weak reason to make it more roaming. We want to accomplish the mechanism dream. So. Of having all these robots protecting the people of the Commonwealth, and I think we should just. I think I'll. We'll probably do a little bit of time warp again here. Get these guys sent out. <laughs> but oh, so tempting. Just to leave it as it is. Okay, farmer, that's my duck, which is one of my favorite robots, just because of that classic joke. I'll put a link in the description. If you don't know Buddy Hackett. You gotta click the link in the description. Okay, just just trust me. And we'll send him. We'll send him to Grey Garden. Or should we send him to Green Top Nursery? One of the, He's gotta go someplace. Yeah, we'll go to Green Top Nursery. We will send. Farmer Miller to Grey Garden. Basic Bob. Where can we send Basic Bob? Where would be Starlight Driving? We'll send him there. Okay, 
lefty. Uh, ten pounds of fluff for that. This is just getting so random. Construction Carl. Now, Construction Carl, I've had plans for. He's definitely going. Where do you think? Murkwater Construction Site. You see what I did there? You see? Huh? Yeah. Full the flow. Flow and Full used to be at the movie theater. Where can we send her that would be kind of cool? I like Float and Flow. Um, group Manor, Jamaica Plain, Sunshine Tidings. Sanctuary Hill. We can still send one to Sanctuary Hills from here. Now that's interesting. I feel like that's got to be something special. And she's pretty special. Country Crossing, Flow and Flow. You guys are all walking out. Cleaning things up a little bit. Here we got random, a random, a random. What's called Radar O'Reilly. The skinny little guy. I don't think we got. Robbie. I forget what I think Robbie. I have no recollection where I was going with that. We'll send Robbie to Sanctuary Hills. That's. This is this guy. Hold on, Robbie. Yeah, I'm trying to. Sergeant Apogee. Okay, he was originally from. Uh... We'll send him to the castle. Ooh, the Boston Airport. There we go. Supply line to the Boston Airport. I don't even know if you could do anything with the Boston Airport, but... Supply line him... to the castle. <laughs> He's totally, totally, unbelievably hard to pick that up. Raynor has got order. nothing going. I have no He's built to sustain with a hat on him. Of course, so. Lost on Earth, not on Mars. With that name, you can't find anything Sensor array. How can we not do a sensor array? We just have to. We can keep traveling as much as we want. I don't require sleep or Let's do this. Let's do, let's do hydraulic the whole way. Um, instead of that, I mean, he needs weapons because, I mean, that's just how it is. But what would make the most sense? Laser gap on that one. I must apologize for the odd noises I'm currently emitting. A consequence of being mechanical in nature. We're going for the left. You lead the way and I'll follow, sir. There's poisonous smoke bomb. Now that's an interesting one. Self-diagnostic complete. I'm happy to report I won't be falling apart on you anytime soon. Gamma gun. They can't pick anything up. The gamma gun kind of looks like a radar thing. My databanks are continuing to accumulate vast so amounts of data regarding the Commonwealth. It's hard to get past that shish kebab because the shish kebab is such a, it, it's got it's part of the lore. You know what I'm saying? Hammer saw. And it looks cool. We're gonna do that. Put the coolie out here. Yeah. Legs. Traveling with you is proving to be quite enlightening. So, I mean, with all this hydraulic armor, I trust you're enjoying my company. Tough. You and I make quite okay, a heavy gun and the thing that just beats people down and sets them on fire. I think it's okay now. I wouldn't no, mind it's pretty good, right? Radar. Good luck with all that. Yeah. It's a lovely character. A pleasure to see you. Lovely character. You know, we're not going to talk to you. We're going to make you a supply line. <sighs> Finch Farm? 
one of the farms. Abernathy's. Let's send let's send lovely carrot to the Abernathy's. I think that's good. Look at all this stuff I have to build. Okay, let's do the time warp again. Is that just too wrong? We'll do it. And of course. Confirm. Why have they all stopped dancing? Now this one, you wait to call it a Couldn't figure out which name I wanted to use. Okay, why are you calling a robot the Nautilus? Because I'm going to send him to Far Harbor, but he doesn't have jets, so you have to go underwater to do that. So I gave him kind of a submarine paint job. I tried to put stuff that looks very submarine ish. Kind of laser, laser. Pretty good. Nautilus supply line somewhere. The visitor center. Yes, that'll work. Send him to the visitor center. That means he's going to Fahaba. I know it's a rare big one that I built down here, but I have trouble getting in and out. But it is what it is. And they're dancing again. Ooh, I leveled up. <laughs> See, building robots is good for your character. My onboard I was thinking, I should have done this with dance in my, uh... I think dance likes it. Eh, to me it doesn't matter. I prefer the dog. I'm trying to build stuff that doesn't require aluminum. We're getting low on aluminum. Some might say aluminium. Red seems like she belongs in Eggman's Alley. This unit is currently in factory default mode. Do you wish to enable this unit's personality? This unit is currently in factory default mode. Do you wish to enable this unit's personality subroutine? Unit it's more of a rush than just trying to. Okay, finally we got into the assignment thing. Melon heads unassigned. Line. Oh, he's a melon head. He needs to go to a farm. Finch farm. It is what it is. I should probably have a tank going for him, but hey. Junk and Johnny supply line. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Outpost Zemoja. That's not a bad assignment. And I think we'll leave him kind of junky. 
Let's, let's at least get, we'll get him so he's survivable. He's a pleasure to see you again, sir. Yeah. Cannonball McGurk is here. I don't remember him being here before. My systems are continuing to function at peak efficiency. Show. I'm going real cheap on all these. Mm -hmm. Measure count. Simply trying to do the cheapest. Yeah, we'll do store counters. That would make sense. But we need to really to see you again, sir. Are you ready? Warmonger stores played. Junk and Johnny. Yeah, sensor aid. Look at the I'm okay with the head. Torso, left arm. I hope I haven't said so anything offensive. What would be hammers good? Construction. That'd be useful for Duncan, wouldn't it? I would use the loom. already assigned, so he must be assigned here. Or from here. Who's that? Who's, this in? Who's that in the corner? What happens when you know this? How many we got? What? Four? I think four. I'm going with cruel fight fleet for this one because I've got a lot of copper. Really? Well, you know what? This will be good. Let me maybe do a couple of water runs or something here and get some more materials. And then we can build, build these guys up a little bit bigger. 
Because the last few places are out on the edges of the map where bad things happen. I guess you, you might want to see some stuff blow up by now, right? Okay, we're under attack or Okay, let's, let's, let's cheat. Okay, we've gone back one save, this and definitely still here. These guys are still walking, but we're gonna go to the Starlight Drive. And has already helped defend it. Okay, we're gonna have to be quick here. Default mode. This may take a couple of runs. Can we find that robot in the middle of the combat and assign him to a supply line? I mean, robots are expensive. I mean, it's not even just, you know, the fact that he looked cool. I don't remember what I did with him. But there's a lot of pieces in there. Let's see. Where is he? 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 Come on. Let's start this up. Well, that's it, huh? There we go. There's one. Patrolman. Okay, he's, he's this. Uh, supply line. Go to Oberlin Station. I don't even care what. See, now I don't think he'd be killed. What does he do? He's already, he's already supply lined out. This one, I mean, he's, he doesn't even have a proper name. What the? Obviously built up. I mean, that's a, you know, except for the name. Powering At least we saved him. Okay, so at least we saved a robot. We got some gunner stuff here. I don't know. Gunner conscript. There's got to be more than one gunner. Um, feral ghoul. Okay, that's from before, I guess. There we go. That's what we need. Okay, so I came back. And there's a lot of stuff going on here. Alright. He's assigned... Sign the sign the skipper. We sent the skipper here. We, we did that. Sign the skipper. I mean, shouldn't the skipper be going to Spectacle Island or someplace islandy? I wonder where he's going to. Yeah, let's let that go. If he's based out of here, he might be uh, at some place in Ireland. Oh my god. Yeah, he might have signed. We're going to leave a sign. We're going to, wherever it went, they have to see. they're just coming back. So that's, we have these guys here to work with, but let's, let's, let's see if we can talk to Isabella. Uh, she might want me to do some work. Isabel, are you tracking any more of your rogue bots? Tracking? Yes. I can check on that for you. Okay, next time. This one trade. I'd like to trade a few things. Sure. Take a look. Isabella Cruz, we want all your junk. All of your junk. Give us your junk and all that really cool stuff there, like the fiber optics and the oil and the ooh, the kind of stuff you use to build robots. Isabella Bella. Purified water. I know you'd like some. We have a lot of, a lot of money here. Yeah, enough water. Carrying too much, blah blah blah. But at least it's getting to be very robot around here, even without these few guys just wandering about. How is it that you have a lit cigarette? You know? And I did notice the left foot bones. That's just weird too. Stogie. Yeah, things are getting more robotic already. I trust you're enjoying my company. Well, you actually, and I make quite an effective team. But the, the neat thing here is that this is all happening, and it doesn't affect the settlement happiness. So, we have guns on the ground. 
thought there were some people assigned out to those. I don't think any other robots back there, are there? I wonder if they'll auto assign. So just let it go. Hmm. You know what? Here, we found 257 again. Let us move them. We can't send them to any of the robot places, I don't think. The mechanics layer is used up. Even if I even if I pop my you know pop something it's used up. But if we can send him to Grey Garden, can we send him to Grey Garden? Yeah. Then he's still in ray, in robot. Tracking lost. Here we go again. Patrolman Moodle McDoodle. Now I wonder if he's assigned to Grey Garden. Can I also then supply line him from here, even though he's set to Grey Garden? We can't send him to Grey Garden. Starlight Drive-In. Okay. So now he's, he'll come back between here and... The, that's good. That's good. I like that. Now, there's one other thing I want to do with you, though. Let's give you a name. Craft. You need it. You're well armed. Heavy laser duty here. Starlight in your face because he's got double lasers. You get it? It's just okay. Good enough. I'll remember where he's going. Looks like we got some uh, some late arrivals, Gerard Depardieu. All right, Gerard, we're gonna have we're we're, we're out of room, I think. Here, at, if you look at our, our our data, our workshops. If you look at, we got 29 people there. That's pretty close to maxed out. I'd have to do drugs to get more people there. Um, same thing with the mechanist layer. 28. That's, you know, we... Again, if I use drugs, I would be able to get maybe one more person there. But I don't feel like doing that just yet, so temporarily... We can keep traveling as much as you want. We're going to move Gerard Depardieu to Grey Garden. Don't require sleep or food in order to survive. Leonard Fuchs. He can go to Grey Garden, too. Because Grey Garden is a place of robots and scrap and salad. You're also going to Grey Garden. And Grey Garden is another place that makes sense to send robots out from as far as, you know, having it as a hub of supply activity. It's, it's a farm. It makes perfect sense, right? And it's already loaded with robots, so hey, you know. Not gonna affect the numbers. Okay, I just I just got XP for no reason whatsoever. Ooh, wait a minute, wait a minute. If I'm getting XP for no reason whatsoever, that means somewhere my robots just blasted the crap out of something. I'm willing to bet. See, it's starting to work for me. Okay, so this robot is a female done up in lots of cruel plate because I'm burning through aluminum like there's no tomorrow building a big tank like this. But what we will do, I think. We're going to rename this one Big Red. Looks like we just did red. You know, it's just cool. All right. Now, you might wonder why did I want a tank on this one? There's always so many different buttons to exit. Let's be confusing. There we go. Already overloaded, Big Red. Okay, let's supply line you. Someplace tricky. I'm thinking Somerville Place, because Somerville Place is way down at the bottom of the map. So he'll take care of, he'll take care of that one. While we craft up another one. Okay, we're naming this one Sharenkov. You can't see him. That one's in the way. 
and he's got a bunch of radiation boosts on him. I actually, I'm out of adhesive. The factory default mode. So, things got limited. Units personality subroutine. Unit remaining in factory default yeah, mode. Please do that. Supply line. We are just about running. I tell you what, the one that's going to Spectacle Island is going to be bone stock, I think. For the time being. Alright, so you're done. And this one, I, I'm gonna bring you along with me on the next one because I don't even know what I can do. 200. In the head, fairly certain we think that we make, we can't do that. I guess we can make them because we have them. Sentry head, we had one, so we could do that. We're gonna call this guy spare parts, I think. Head armor. Can't make anything. Ahab's helm. Why do we have an Ahab's helm? Like, not sure. Is that like one of the ones? Oh, we'll have to call him Ahab. I might have gotten that as a special part somewhere. Or so. What can we get? The, 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 the toughest thing we can get. We can get. We must have a front hydraulic unit. We must have a rear front heavy plate. No, we're making that one. Okay. First on mod. We can do a stealth field. That's. We must have had a stealth field. We can do a robo brain. Ah, let's do it in solid combat time. Uh, yeah, I'm not picking up an anonymous 800 number. They can, they can call someone else. Okay, let's do wicked noxious just for the heck of it. At least that has some kind of effect. We'll do a left hand laser, left hand claw, solitron claw. A left missile launcher. You know, I haven't really done a missile launcher or anything. Why not? Crane arm. Excuse <coughs> the mod. That's the best. That's the best we can do, gang. We're down to spare parts. Right hand shot. Okay, well, hey, you know, right hand shocker, that's not a bad up close and personal. The best thing we can do is there another laser and assault on the right hand claw might be good, but no, I think, I think that's fine. And we got Savage Spike Plate. Alright, that, that has a multiplier to it. Legs. We can put him. We can put up Mr. Handy Thruster. Huh? That might save us some, you know, some issues. And we can go all the way up to. We'll see. Thruster Savage. Let's do Cool. Cool kind of. Cool. What looks better? Sinister. That's sinister. We haven't done Sinister. Let's see. Voice. We'll keep a male voice. He's got the Ahab helm. Blue paint. Dark blue paint. Rename. Captain Ahab. Of the spare parts. I mean, I don't know. Do I want to put of the spare parts? He's just cobbled together from spare parts, but that gives that gives Captain Ahab here a little bit of a, you know, that there's some history to him there. You know, you get the, the feeling that there's something going on. I, I like that. All right. Exit the station. Identity confirmed. This unit is ready to serve. All right, and you're gonna be you're gonna serve momentarily as soon as I can get. Supply line G. I guess we're going to send uh, Captain Ahab to Spectacle Island, which really does kind of work out. 
And we are done here. We can send no one else. It was exactly the right number of robots. Nice. See, you know, this is this is the kind of thing we would expect to see. Same kind of deal up here. Look at all the radiation that's coming out of here. Well, not radiation, but the radiant lines coming out of here. Now let's find Grey Garden. I have a couple over there. Okay, so here we are now. That's, if you know. Looking to trade, then let's make a deal. Okay, there he's built in. Where are the robots yeah. this time here? First of all, did they survive? Yes. Help defend the checkpoint. Oh, here yeah, we got a checkpoint defense there. A little bit of excitement. I see lunches of lasers. Oh, gunner does he. That successful? Can we blow someone in the next week? What happened to the... There you go. You know, traditions of the wasteland, of course, leave them naked. They wouldn't, they wouldn't want all that to go to waste. Steel? Yeah, we need steel. We need all kinds of parts at this point. Taking all your stuff, because that's what kind of general I am. <laughs> It'll respawn, don't worry, I'm sure. If it doesn't, well... They're actually not going to touch it. I mean, they, they have unlimited weapons. We, we keep them going. And they can just shoot all the stuff that they want. All right, well, that's good. That means we've got a, you know, this is a good location to have a, as a base of operations. Where are my other robots? That's a supervisor. I just sent a bunch of them. Now, it could be that they're not here yet. I mean, that's, that makes perfect sense. Be an app. Hmm, do you see any unassigned robots? <laughs> Hanging out on the inside. Oh, check it out. Here they are. Well, that worked out well. Okay, Leonard. Let's see. Supply line. Now, where should we send him? We should send him either to the slug, where, uh, what do you call it? Because Curie's at the slug currently. Or we could send him to where her lab is. Let's see. What's available? Echo Lake Lumber Mill or the slug? Which one's it going to be? The slog's not coming up. Am I missing it? Maybe your eyes are better than mine. All right, well, hey, then that kind of settles it. You're going to Echo Lake Lumber Mill, back where you used to be. Uh-huh, yeah, there you go. You there, Scrap and Sally. Where should we send Scrap and Sally? Finch Farm usually needs a lot of support. But no, we'll send, you know, we'll send the tank up to Finch Farm. No, no, we're going to send... This one a Finch Farm. Queen Farm. Does it make wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Does it make sense to send a supply line from a farm to a farm? Sanctuary Hills. That's not a bad plan. And then we'll have more support up by Sanctuary Hills. It's not that far. Alright, let's do that. Meanwhile, we have Gerard Depardieu. Gerard! Where the heck is it? Somerville Place! Doesn't it seem like Gerard Depardieu should be going to Somerville Place? Like, there, that would be a movie he'd act in or something like that. If you don't know who Gerard Depardieu is, you have to Google him. Pretty cool. I don't know what he's like personally. I know for a while there, back in the day, he was very popular as an actor for a while. And he has a cool name, Gerard Depardieu. It just makes you... I don't even remember why I built that robot. 
<laughs> Where I was going with that, I don't know. He was involved in some kind of controversy some years ago, but I don't remember what it was. It was one of those standard kind of what the heck kind of things. Professor Brown. Any other random assignable? Just a Mr. Handy assigned to food. Alright, he's just one of the ones from here. One of the things that makes Grey Garden Grey Garden. Alright. Oh, Taffington Boathouse is under attack. But let's see, do we have any effect here? We'll roll out there. Are these guys just showing up? Are they unassigned? Retgar, you just got here. Okay, supply line. Uh, let's see. To the Taffington Boathouse, maybe? I want to say Merkwater, so Dalton Farm, that's another good one. I like, you know, it's Coastal Cottage. Man, he's slow. And mostly underarmed. <laughs> and I don't have any parts to work with here, Gretgar. We're just going to have to get you on the flip-flop. Uh, what do you think? What do you think mostly... The Dalton Farm? Dalton Farm's a good place. Now nah, I want to keep Rekar on this side of thing. We'll send him to Taffington Boathouse, which just happens to be under attack. I know I would normally send stuff to. Uh, it's either it's either something. It's, these are all kind of water related. Let's do Taffington Boathouse just because. And Flash. Completely unbuilt up. We'll 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 catch up with you later, Flash. I'm out of parts. I think. We could try. We'll send Flash. Flash has got to go to the Dalton farm. That's like not even... I can't even explain why, but that's just... Weird. Let's see. We could probably do try to do some upgrades to, to Flash here in the meantime before he walks anywhere. Rekgar's still Rekgar. He's kind of what I wanted him to be. Let's see, what spare parts can we throw on Flash before we teleport ourselves? A bunch of them start to come around. Head. Doom Helm. There you go, the Doom Helm. Do we want the Doom Helm? It's actually ugly. Scourge Helm. We could get a head actuated frame. Alright, you know, that's better. We'll do that. I'm not. Frame. All these spare parts. Your final heavy plate. And you're not going to have any torso mines yet for a while there, Flash. <laughs> We're just taking whatever we can get. You still have missile launchers. Ah, what the heck? Let's get Flash a missile launcher. Right arm. Um. Cool spike plate. What other options we got here? We got a cryo jet, an assaultron claw. Let's give him an assaultron claw <laughs> for the heck of it. I don't know that we have any other arms. No, we have no other arms. Right hand armor, hydraulic frame. Legs, everything other than we got nothing. Primal storage. Cruel spike. Another amalgam of whatever we got here. But at least your legs will match there, Frank. Let's uh male voice. If I could make that extra loud, that would be started. The people who will get this, these jokes will, um... Is it blue or manila? Yeah, you know what? Manila works. No question, but light blue, I think, is the way I want to go. And it, this is this is just all inside my head stuff. Frank, Frank's a good friend of mine. I actually work with his son now. <laughs> Maybe his son might see this. Identity confirmed. And he's headed to, as a supply line to the Dalton farm. 
just beautiful. He's got a missile launch. I think that might... It might or may not be it. I mean, obviously we got some slow robots. What's this one? Colonel Mayberry. Okay, well, you know what? We got... What, what do we have here in the way of... Let's leave him here for right now. Because we still have to defend Tappington, Bo Tappington Boathouse. Quickly. And all you have to do is show up and then the guns take care of it. I mean, I've built all these up. To no end. Ah, check it out, a Minuteman Patrol. Hey, General. And two more robots. Factory default mode. Oh. Do you wish to enable no, I don't. No, no, no. Please don't talk to me. Alright, let's see what we could do with what we've got here for Portnoy and Mayberry. Just burn out the spare parts. Head, let's see, head armor. The Doom Helm. We'll go with the Doom Helm. Torso. We have multiple torsos we could go here. Robo brain torso. We can't, we don't have a, a robo brain head, right? We have a salt or a sentry head. And the head armor. Another Ahab's helm. Okay. But hey, listen, we have a bunch of Ahab's helms. That would be fine. Torso, front armor. Sinister hardened. Let's go with that. Rear armor. Sinister hardened. Torso mod. We already, we're already out of those. Right? Yeah, we're out of torso mod. We'll fix you up later. Um, Saltron left arm. What was Rain left arm? See, this one reduces carrying because the Robo Brain left arm is better. Green spike plate. What have we got? We got a left hand claw. Eh, that's pretty good. Left hand laser. That's a laser claw. That's just a laser. Let's go with the, the left hand claw because we know we can put a melee on it. Primal plate. Um, right arm. It has to be protector arm. We're out of right arms. That's the only thing we can do here. We can. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's do the cryojet. What the heck? Legs. She must have a lot of that just in storage. A lot of cruel spike plate. You, you, you must drop. So I must have a lot of that that has dropped. Male voice paint. How do we want to paint? How would he want to be painted? Yellow, no. White, no. Red, no. Pink, I wasn't no. aware that roaming the Commonwealth could prove so interesting. Dark green. Blue. I don't want to mix them up with the other A. Brown paint, blue paint. Dark green. dark green. We're gonna make it dark green just to, to, to pick some. Exit the station, and now where can we send it? Self diagnostic complete. I'm happy. Supply line. Well, let's send him to Coastal Cottage. Well, he's got an Ahab helm. That's kind of, you know, coastal. Be to report, I won't be falling apart on you anytime soon. And that means. Craft again. We can assign one more robot. Sergeant Pickles? I think. Did we do Sergeant Pickles? We'll do Portnoy, and then if Pickles is unassigned. 
head. Man, I don't even know what we're gonna do. We do another. We do him with the doom realm. I'm gonna scourge him. We might be building this. Oh, adds chance for targets to explode. Identity confirmed. This unit is ready to serve. Merciless Harden. It's all that mean stuff that I hardly ever use. They have a different style to my robots usually. Let's see. Arms. We got an assault front arm. Oh, look at all of this. We could not just, not just. There we go. Chance no to be poisoned while you explode. Entering wait mode. We got lasers. So let's see. Let's let's leave that as the claw for the time being. Running self-diagnostic on audio pickups. And what's on his um his right arm? With the left, I don't even know. Oh, that's a robot standing in front of me. Um, let's see, right hand claw. Can we do a laser on this? Solitron right hand claw. Right hand laser. Yeah, we'll do a light hand. right hand Suggestion. laser. State commands clearly for proper response. Legs. No other options. Mid armor, storage primals. Match up the primal with the primal. There you go! Portnoy! We didn't paint him. Craft. Portnoy. We gotta paint ya. Portnoy! Portnoy. Portnoy begins with P, and so does P. Identity confirmed. This unit That'll offset the scariness of the Doom Helm. Or make it worse. One of the two. And then... Come on, we have to get into... Come on. I, I don't want to change view. I want to enter the thing with the queue. And you gotta go to Murkwater. There's just no other place for you to go. Hey! Blank <coughs> out. Now where is... Oh, I should've stayed up there. Darn it. Then I can pull up Sergeant Pickles easily enough. Hurt myself for no reason whatsoever. I hurt myself today. Pickles. Exit the station because he's built up. Uh, it's astounding how much we still have to discover. And he's not, he's already assigned. Okay, we couldn't assign him from here anyway. Identity confirmed. There's something to be said for those big red laser beam things. That's the big red light. And so we'll have to see here now how it kind of all works out. Let's see, if we run all the way, we'll take the walk back. The walk to Sanctuary. The run, I'm running. Well, Mongol, can you hit the thing there? No, okay. Okay, this is a that that was a quantum swarm bot that was killed many. Welcome to Strongbadia. <laughs> I forgot I named, renamed it Strongbadia, which is why I had Fahala gods and those guys here. <laughs> now they're all on. Now they're all somewhere else, walking back and forth. Greatest thought we were easy pickets. We I'm leaving the sign up though. It's still strong, baddie. Yeah. And not seeing. Oh, here's. Mama Murphy's as good as her work. No more hey, Carla. No Need to pick sight. something up? Yeah, well, it's why pretty not. long from here. I'll take a look. Sure. I got. Well, Somerville Place certainly looks a little bit more reinforced. Let's take a look at it. So here we have a here we have a completely unmarked location. And this was this was full of soda. I even got a cherry. Some cool stuff here. 
And for some reason, I looked down and I wasn't recording. I don't know why. I hear more bugs. Um, that. Hello. I use that so infrequently. I have no idea how to get into it. How's, how's that? Is it a queue or something? Space is just... How is funny is that? I actually use VAT so infrequently I forgot. It's been months. I mean, seven months since I've played the game. Although B would make sense. Tab, no, I think that up. Caps lock, shift, control, like crouches, halt. Ah! Oh, that's how you punch people. All right. Caps turns on and off to run. All right, let's go investigate here. And yes, you guys are. Feel free to laugh at me for forgetting that. Oh, watch, now that'll make the whole thing, like, you know, completely unmonetizable, because, you know. It'll probably be unmonetizable eventually anyway, just for the sheer violence of the whole thing. They're getting... Can I fast travel, or are enemies nearby? Where do we want to fast travel to? Mechanist Lair? Maybe just outside the Mechanist Lair. Because I'd like to see if you see any robots just zipping around out here. And yes, this may mean I have to shoot stuff. Now, this is an interesting thing that if you saw that there, they're talking about the soldiers in T-60 power armor trying to retain order. Um, that's the only place it was used. It never saw wartime combat, and Oxhorn was just talking about this, so it's funny that that should come up. Beware long load screens. Now let's work our way towards the Mechanist Lair. Do we see any robots? Man, it's grim down here. Anything moving in and out. Because that's what I would expect. We'll work our way around the mechanist layer a little bit, maybe. Oh, here you go. Uh, yes. This is where humans would gather to accumulate knowledge. Yeah, there we go. We got some Perhaps robots. If more robots possessed my mercy algorithm, we wouldn't be forced to destroy them. You know, that's an interesting point. The mercy algorithm. That's really what the mechanists robots lacked. They just just killed everything. Whereas these, who is that anyway? Everything seems to be identity confirmed. Skipper. There's the skipper. We got another one coming around this way, and they're going out into the water. <laughs> there goes the skipper. Heading on out. Oh, and someone's shooting somebody somewhere. Monitoring the Commonwealth is proving to be quite rewarding. I'm glad. What a fascinating place. So this is actually kind of working out the way I'd hoped. We, you know, it's not like massive amounts of robots all going back and forth in a pack, like which is what I kind of wanted to do. But there's limitations to the game. What's that? Seems like it's coming. Rust proof, radiation proof, and a lifetime supply of power. I couldn't ask for more. Uh, 
I love this gun. And there's a cow stuck in the... Ah, crap all that. Okay, so there was... You know, maybe that's one of the robots' cows. Yeah, a bit. So that's the one problem with the guys. You have to really kind of look for stuff later on. And poison things from the school. All right, hey. You're not doing anybody any good here. Help defend Dalton Farm. But perhaps we'll come in here. Take a look around. We got, hey, we got robots on the move. Cycling through here. That's got to make Isabella happy. She loves the whole robot thing. We've pretty much accomplished her dream. She probably put the suit on. I am the mechanist. If I had any idea where I'd put that, then we'd do that. But first, let's go to Far Harbor, and then go to the Dalton Farm, and then see what there is to see. Sometimes you end up with a side quest when you get to have to defend Dalton Farm, I've noticed. So we might have to go and knock some, you know, some trappers out or something like that. Come on. Load. Beware long loading screens. That means more enemies, right? Classic video game logic that may or may not be true. Okay, we have to go to Longfellow's Cabin New. Show supply lines so it simplifies things. The Dalton Farm. Fast travel. Whee! Too bad you can't see the whole map at once and just go right to the Dalton Farm. But hey, I understand the limitations of the programming. As we look at a, a, a robot repair kit here. Come on, come on, come on. That's probably what was a long loading screen. We're loading up a whole other world. Okay, let's get inside. Temporarily. Just raining down. Okay, that was relatively easy. What was it? Hey, we got some condensed fog. I hardly ever get any condensed fog. I don't. Glowing mutant hound and nuclear material. Okay, nuclear material is good. Oh, the phones. All right, but well, while we're here, do we have... First of all, everybody looks kind of happy hanging out here. No secondary quest launched. Got a little fusion generator thing going there. Do we have any robots? Walking up. That's a long trick, so they haven't be getting here yet. So I do like this. This was another good... Good build. Man, is it heavily armed. Well, while we're up here, let's take a look at the supply lines. As you can see, it looks like everything is connected. We're not missing anything. You know, Longfellow's cabin's covered. The visitor center's covered. Dalton Farm's covered two different ways. Echo Lake Lumber. It's got direct feed from the from, from the Commonwealth. As well as someone coming from Dalton Farm. How's our workshops look happiness-wise? Right, we get 69 here. Let's see. That's... I don't even know what's that, but I don't know what we can do with Boston Airport. Boston Airport's going to be another day. Because, I don't know, I guess when we finish the game, even though we didn't finish it for the Brotherhood, we get Boston Airport? I don't know. Bunker Hill. Then Bunker Hill needs work. Coastal Cottage. 
Postal cards, I don't understand why that's not doing better. I mean, the food is low, but it gets fed from everything else. We'll have to get more food at the Coastal Cottage. And I think, I think I've planted the food, it's just that people have to be assigned. We'll get them working. Country Crossing, oh, that's in a warning state. No, more than enough beds, more than enough food, more than enough water, more than enough power. The defense is high. I don't know what the problem is. Some of this stuff does glitch out. But now, Croup Manor, which you would not think would be the happiest place in the world, that's up to 80. So that's, we got Dalton Farm. How's Dalton Farm? 82. Echo Lake, 80. Finch Farm, 80. Grey Garden, 67, but there's a lot of robots. Green Top, 65. 60. Well, Hangman's Alley, I've beaten up. We have to work on Hangman's Alley. To make a plane, to make a plane, 78 is pretty good. 18 and 18, gonna get more food going there. So there's work to be done, but. Things like Kingsport Lighthouse up in the 80s. Longfellow Cabin. I don't even know why that would... Everything looks happy there. Merkwater. 44. Why is it... Oh, that's glitched. We have to go there. That's a glitch. I think there's no beds. Or no water. No power. That, I hate that glitch. So we have to get that back up before we lose it. Hogden's okay. Oberlin's okay. There's nothing really anomalous in the numbers there. The Moja's 80. That's, you know, Red Rocket. It's going to be 50. It's nothing but robots. Sanctuary Hill, 74. That's glitched out. So why does that happen? So we have to go to Sanctuary Hills. Somerville Place, which would not you think would be rough, is up at 84. Spectacle Island, 79. Starlight Drive-In, 80, but falling because I don't even know why. There's no real problems there. Sunshine Tidings, 80. Tappington. We're doing pretty good. The castle's up at 87. That's a mechanist lair. 53. Full of robots. The slog. Man, there's no reason the slog shouldn't be just thrilled. To go there at some point. The visitor center's happy. Warwick Holmes. So we're, we're doing pretty good. I think we may have. Let's go to the map. Let's get out of, get out of this place. Back to the Commonwealth. I wonder why I have armor up there. Did I leave an armor suit somewhere along the way? But we'll collect all that at some point. Okay, let's get over here. Okay, and now I have to help defend Sanctuary Hill. At least we have robots. Who's here? This unit is the Mudslinger! He must be a local boy. Oh, uh, yeah, from, he's probably a Merkwater one. Is he, is he, uh, is he a, uh... Come on. Fire up. Yeah. He must be one of the ones coming out. The Mudslinger. That's too perfect for, for this area. Help defend Sanctuary. Jeepers. Well, you know what? That's because it's glitched out and the numbers are all bad. So we're going to have to do that pretty darn pronto. Alright, how does, how does this look now? Murkwater. See, now everything looks fine. And you got 14 people, 24. We got more food than people, more water than people, more power than people, or whatever it is. Defense is 351. And we have 42 beds. There's no reason for this that 40 uh, for uh, happiness. But now let's get to the map. Break out the map. Sanctuary is under attack. Jeepers. Why would, you know, I wonder if, how this will work out. What spawn point are they going to use? Because there are certain spawn points I don't have heavily defended. And everyone's just going to have to, you know, shoot them. I mean, you have fewer robots now, but... There may be some that are back up there just as far as, uh, you know, delivering supplies. And then they'll shoot them. Come on. Let's see what happens. If we look at this... I guess it's good to look at a musket here while we... A crank up musket while we're going to sink to it. Anyway. Where's the bad guys? Okay. Well, obviously the security was good enough. What did you find, boy? They dropped it in the dark. Or kept it. One of the two. All right, well, did we at least fix the sanctuary data now? All right, yeah, 17 people, 21 food, 30 water, 23 beds. There's, yeah, it's 
We're, well, that's Abernathy. We're Sanctuary. Sanctuary Hills. That's better. 2250. More water than you could possibly think about. Power, defense, 27 beds. Tappiness. Yeah, tappiness should be going up. That's just ridiculous. And I think it's only appropriate that we kind of wrap this up where it started, mostly. Here in the Mechanist Lair. Look at this! It's chock full of robots and ramen and what's that? Is that an un... Izzy's Beach Bum? I don't... Who's Izzy? There's probably a video where I explain that, what Izzy is. Yeah, we're not... Let's see, should we fix up Izzy? That'll be the last thing we do today is fix up the beach bum. Uh, craft. This should prove interesting. I wonder what you'll build next. Looks like we can do just about anything Let's now. We've gotten some junk. So looks like he's gonna be very well actuated. Oh, not front and back. Let's see. Primal. We'll go primal rest of the From laying on the beach. Mr. Harden? That might be a better one. Can't do a mod yet. Left arm. Give him an assault on my farm and just happen to have one. I must apologize for the odd noises I'm currently emitting. Actuated? Yeah, we can go actuate it. Keep it to a theme. Okay, left hand laser. We're still scraping the, the parts bin here, folks. Left hand laser. So trick, let's see. That does that much damage. Let's go with the left hand laser. Better. My gift away is continuing to accumulate right arm. That's all we got. That's all we got. We can do that. That's a bit of a grade. And leg. That's all we got. That's all we got. That's all we got. That's all we can. Keep it all prime. That's all we can. Oh, we get to figure out what we're gonna do with that. The paint, beach bum paint. Now, here we're gonna be a beach bum. I'm gonna let you know, Manila paint. Is there a paint? It's a pleasure to serve with you, sir. So you'll blend in with the sand. Hey, see, you didn't expect an upgrade today, did you? Identity confirmed. So, it looks like we may have just robots drifting in and out, and they're all gone. They've all deployed. Except for good old Disney and all these robots here, of course. Now Izzy's going to collect his cow and roll, and I think this is the best place to end it, folks. This was a lot more work than what I'd intended, let me tell you. But at least now, we can be look at the, let's take a look at our handiwork here. Show the supply lines. This is the thing I want. I want this concentration of robots and all of these robots just fanning out through the whole Commonwealth. There's hardly anywhere in the Commonwealth where you might not find one of my robots taking care of business. Any help, God help anything that runs into them. Well, I mean, not the... God cares about video games necessarily, but I mean, I'm just saying that you know, they're good. They're, they're pretty. Okay, so I guess I guess we just have a cow on the roof now. That's like a thing. This is just a little a little. This is him here. You're right, night. Have a great night. Cannonball McGurk. I know I updated. It. He was built like a tank. He was a big one. I mean, I'm pretty sure you even see him in this video. And now he's back to stock, and I don't know why. So, after investing all of this in these robots, are they all just going to slowly glitch out to 
this complete stock? I mean, is that just... Well, there's a thanks, Bethesda, for you. Wow, that's just... 